Well, hello, Mission Hills Church. Time for another midweek update. Uh, this Sunday is obviously a beautiful Sunday. This is officially Christmas Sunday, the last Sunday before we celebrate Christ's birth on the 25th. So be sure to be here. We've got a very, very special service for you. Both services will be the normal times, 9 o'clock and 11. But the services will be beautiful. Not only will we look into God's Word and take a peek at the actual birth of Jesus Christ and what it means for us today, We'll have Frank and the band leading us in worship, but added to that, our children are gonna be on the platform and they're gonna be singing a beautiful song, just especially for Christmas. So that will be great. So don't miss this Sunday, nine and 11 o'clock. And by the way, you know, this is also the official Mission Hills Church Christmas sweater Sunday. So wear your favorite Christmas sweater. It might be beautiful, and sophisticated. It might be zany and crazy. It might even just be flat out ugly. It doesn't matter. You wear the Christmas sweater that you want to wear and uh, we'll see what shows up. I'm wearing mine. So we'll see you this Sunday, 9 and 11 o'clock, like I keep saying. Anyways, um, then we've got Christmas Eve right back here in the worship center. We have two services for Christmas Eve, three in the afternoon and five in the afternoon. The Christmas Eve service will be um, our candlelight service. It will last one hour. Please bring people. You've got those invite cards, right? I hope you're using those invite cards, but bring a friend or invite a stranger to come to one of those two services. We'll finish the services out on the patio uh, by candlelight, have a chance to sing a final song together out there. And of course, we don't ever want to go to the patio without hot beverages, coffee, cocoa, tea, as well as the homemade, fresh, very, very delicious mini donuts that'll be made for us right there on the spot on the patio. So that's the Christmas Eve service. So those two services, Sunday coming up this weekend and then Christmas Eve are the next two times that we'll be together um, here in the worship service. And I, I know all of you by now have um, become aware of the, the recent uh, state mandate for wearing masks on indoor services for the next month. Um, I just simply encourage you, wear a mask when you come to the services. We appreciate that, okay? Uh, the last thing I want to share with you is uh, also important. Mike Schrader, who you know is our men's pastor, he is also our local outreach pastor. Mike is actually transitioning in January from full-time to a part-time ministry. It just works better in the end for him, and that's important. So he's going to be doing men's ministry and then drive-through prayer. And what I want to make sure you know is we've got all the other local outreach ministries covered. Uh, we talk about the midweek meal, um, all of our ministries to the schools, the appreciation lunch we do for the city employees, and on and on and on. We have a full calendar of local outreach activities, and you will not notice a difference. We're not canceling anything. Everything is perfectly covered. So as we go into 2022, you'll see Mike around a lot because he's still on our staff, and we look forward to all that will happen moving forward through his ministry. We're just going to be covering the local outreach a little bit differently, okay? So that's what I got for you today for this midweek update. I trust you're doing well. I know it's a busy time, but let's be people that are grateful and can pause long enough to enjoy the peace that Jesus gives us, especially during this time of year. So uh, a Merry Christmas in advance, and I'll see you Sunday morning. God bless you.